Something tremendous has occurred recently. It becomes much more intriguing when you consider Coinbase. To far, this is the highest total for the year. Now, billions is a pejorative term. The topic of trillions is front and center now. But why is this even taking place? Why do we have to wait a whole year for it anyway? Okay, I'll try to clarify. Important notice. A surprising development occurred today. The analytics community just made a shocking discovery in the cryptocurrency realm. Incredibly large transactions totaling 4 trillion Shiba Inu tokens were discovered by diligent on-chain data geeks. Where are we going? Not anyone else than Coinbase, a leading U.S. exchange. This huge infusion is equivalent to almost $100 million in hard money. Hold on a second. Let's take a deep breath and absorb that. This is a mind-boggling amount. To get a better picture, picture a mountain of money, towering, over skyscrapers like pebbles. In the world of cryptocurrencies, this is a monumental leap. First of all, it's quite unusual to witness such enormous sums being shifted about, particularly in the Shiba Inu domain. There may be a tidal surge of enthusiasm, conjecture, and perhaps even some restless nights for. Those who betray their trust if this inflow has major consequences for the market. But what precisely transpired just now? I suppose so. A staggering 4.29 trillion Shiba Inu coins allegedly found their way to the biggest U.S.-Dash cryptocurrency exchange. The fact that these tokens were spread out across only 10. Wallets adds a, another layer of intrigue, impressive level of focus. Tokens were purchased over two separate periods, three years apart, and this is where things become interesting. There was a round in March of this year, and the first one was caught in September of 2021. Even better, the astute owners snagged these trillions of coins when they were priced nearly twice as low as they are today. Now let's go to the present. Furthermore, at the present Shiba Inu price, these holders stand to gain a tidy $41 million. So let's pause for a second to take that all in. Of course, it could be wrong. Of those spectacular news grabbing, all profits for which cryptocurrency is known. But come on, we need to give props where they are due. Making tens of millions of dollars from a small investment? It's not bad at all. It's the equivalent of a grand slam in the cryptocurrency universe. A respectable base hit, perhaps not a grand slam. Also, Monday we discussed a major Shiba Inu transaction. Yes, that one where Robinhood transferred an unprecedented 6000000000000000 Shiba Inu tokens. It found out that Robinhood was simply rearranging its own data. What happened with Coinbase today? That's an entirely separate matter. Why all that Shiba Inu wound up there? It is a mystery to us. The rumor mill, I can assure you, is cranking out rumors at an alarming rate. Many hypotheses have been proposed on its motivations and potential market effects. Everybody is attempting to figure out what's going on, and it's like a real-life mystery novel. All of this is only scratching the surface. Assuming the Shiba Inu $100 million ploy pans out, it will pan out. But if you thought the 100 million Shiba Inu move was impressive, you're in for a treat. A huge shift. Occurred in the cryptocurrency market as Coinbase experienced its biggest Ethereum outflow of the year. Plus, we're talking about more than $1.0 according to CryptoQuant, this huge change has everyone talking and has set the market and ETH in a state of uncertainty. Consequently, Ethereum is witnessing substantial withdrawals, but Shiba Inu is witnessing substantial inflows too. Coinbase, the crypto activity is like a seesaw, while simultaneously directing one token upwards and the other below. The most recent data from CryptoQ1 shows that on June 12th, a staggering 336,000 Ether, worth about 1.17 billion USD, were removed from the trading site. This is also not an isolated incident. Withdrawals from Coinbase have reached 150,000 for the fifth time this year. And here's the crazy part. The amounts involved in these deals have varied widely from $400 million to $1.2 billion. You know that some major players are making moves in the market when you find yourself in a situation where you're $1.1 billion. This is obviously not a group of casual Ethereum traders given the magnitude and frequency of these withdrawals. Not at all. It seems more likely that these actions are the result of unseen institutional actors or whales. To put it simply, the ordinary retail dealer really cannot afford to deal with deals of this size. They're bigger, more. 4. Consistent with what one would anticipate from major players who are dealing with enormous stakes and have some clever market strategies brewing. The question of why they are making such drastic changes now arises. Things start to get murky at that point. 
At this stage, we are all merely making assumptions. However, we may be able to learn something by studying past market trends and events. Some hints. Do you recall when, prior to the introduction of Bitcoin detected thefts earlier this year, Coinbase had such massive Bitcoin withdrawals? The present Ethereum evacuation, according to some, might be an indication that people are preparing for future Ethereum spotted thefts. That being said, it's all merely informed speculation, just for the time being. These withdrawals could be a positive indicator for Ethereum's future if they aren't simply the result of the exchange reorganizing internally. This is the reason for it. Removing a large quantity of Ethereum from circulation, particularly one of this magnitude, effectively creates scarcity. Plus, in economics, scarcity is a known price raiser. Think of it as the fundamentals of supply and demand. Ethereum places a premium on that, which is why Ethereum has become so famous. That is why Ethereum holds such sway in the irrational and unpredictable crypto realm, where opinion and market sentiment may change in an instant. Pretty chaotic, actually. Although the immediate market impact of this massive Ethereum migration is uncertain, the general consensus is that this is a good development with promising prospects down the road. Ultimately, the market is only a few days away. There may be significant price increases in the future as a result of increasing the supply of Ethereum and the introduction of new investment goodies such as Ethereum spotted TEFs. Be patient though. A key thing needs to be understood before anyone gets overly excited about the Ethereum ETF entering the market. Here, a prominent executive in the sector seems rather cautious. To clarify, they are arguing that spot Ether ETFs will not see the initial infusion of capital that Bitcoin ETFs did, so let me explain. Bitcoin's relatively simple function as a medium of exchange made it more accessible to investors. Whereas Ethereum? I suppose so. It's not quite as simple. All of Ethereum's value is directly proportional to its worth. It can be more challenging to place a price on technological items such as decentralized apps and smart contracts. The question of how to accurately value Ethereum remains unanswered, according to prominent figure in the financial sector Stephen Richardson. If it cannot be resolved, the avalanche of capital into Ethereum exchange-traded funds ETFs that befell Bitcoin in the past is unlikely to repeat. However, I can tell you one bright spot. While the first day of trading on the Ethereum ETF may not be as exciting, many anticipate that it will have a profound impact on the cryptocurrency market as a whole.